a born again follower of Jesus Christ operates at a different level from the world, from other people. A person who is born of the Spirit of God, who has the Spirit of Christ in him, and who listens to the Holy Spirit, who is guided by the Holy Spirit, operates on the level of the Spirit, whereas other people operate on the level of their senses, their common sense, their desires, their feelings. If you are born of the Spirit of God, your actions are determined by the Holy Spirit because you follow the guidance of the Holy Spirit. You don't do as you think or as you feel or as you want, but as the Spirit of God directs you and you do so because you follow Jesus. You ask Him, the Spirit who lives in you, what He wants you to do. You go where He sends you, and you react in the way that He directs you. That is the difference between a born-again child of God, a son of God, and a natural man, a normal person. We are not normal people. We are sons of God who listen to the voice of our Father and we do His will, His pleasure. We are here to declare the kingdom of God and to live as sons of God in this world. We are not of this world. We are of the kingdom of God. And that is why we overcome the world. Not because we are clever or wise or strong but because we follow the guidance of the Holy Spirit. We are like Jesus. Why do I say like Jesus? We are here to do the will of our Father. We do not act on our own initiative, but we do what He tells us to do. Those who are led by the Spirit of God they are the sons of God. Many call themselves Christians, followers of Jesus, but they are not following Jesus. They are not operating on a higher plane, on a different level. They are not led by the Spirit of God. They are still operating on the level of the natural. Do you operate on the level of the natural? Or do you follow the guidance of the Holy Spirit? Are you truly born again of the Spirit of God? And do you follow the guidance of the Spirit of Christ that dwells inside of you? Do you operate on a different level? May Jesus bless you.